Venus, the planet of love, beauty, and wealth, is finally moving out of its challenging phase as it transits into Libra on September 18, 2024. This shift is not just an astrological event. It marks the end of a period of turbulence and the beginning of a time for restoration and growth in the domains Venus governs. It's important to highlight that these interpretations are drawn from sidereal or Vedic astrology, which considers a roughly 24-degree variance from the tropical zodiac. Libra, symbolized by the scales, represents equilibrium and justice, making this transit a time where these qualities are not only desired but also more easily attainable. Venus at home in Libra, being the planet that governs this sign, and its influence during this transit is especially potent and positive. The energies of this transit can be felt on both personal and collective levels, encouraging a deeper understanding of how we relate to others and our environment. Recently, Venus was debilitated in Virgo and further compounded by its conjunction with Ketu, which may have resulted in a sense of detachment, confusion, and critical issues in relationships and finances. However, as Venus moves into Libra, its mole Tricona sign, it brings a much-needed sigh of relief and an opportunity for damage control and rejuvenation. The past few weeks with Venus and Virgo conjunct K2 have likely been a testing time for many. Virgo, known for its critical and analytical nature, combined with the detaching influence of K2, may have brought about a period of insecurity, misunderstandings, and conflicts in relationships. Financial concerns may have also been prevalent, leading to a sense of instability or lack. During this time, people might have felt overly critical, both of themselves and others, making it difficult to find harmony and satisfaction in personal and professional relationships. The conjunction with Ketu could have amplified feelings of detachment or isolation, making it hard to connect on an emotional level. Venus entering Libra signifies a return to its dignified state, where it can fully express its natural qualities of love, beauty, balance, and diplomacy. Libra, an air sign known for its emphasis on harmony, justice, and relationships, provides a supportive environment for Venus to operate. During this transit from September 18th to October 13th, we can expect a period of healing, restoration, and growth in matters related to Venus. It's a time to rebuild what may have been broken, to replenish what was lost, and to experience prosperity and harmony in relationships, finances, and our general sense of well-being. This transit becomes even more significant when considering the energetic shift it brings. Venus in Libra is all about finding balance and creating harmony in our lives. Whether it's within our personal relationships, professional partnerships, or our inner selves, this transit encourages us to seek equilibrium. Relationships that may have been strained or tested during Venus's time in Virgo can now find a path toward reconciliation and renewed harmony. It's a time to mend fences, to open up lines of communication, and to approach conflicts with a sense of fairness and a desire for mutual understanding. Venus in Libra also enhances our appreciation for beauty and the arts. You might find yourself drawn to more artistic and cultural activities during this time, whether it's attending a concert, visiting an art gallery, or simply finding joy in the aesthetic aspects of life. This transit inspires us to surround ourselves with beauty, to create environments that are pleasing to the senses, and to appreciate the finer things in life. In terms of finances, Venus in Libra encourages us to make decisions that bring balance and enhance our sense of well-being. This could be a favorable time for investments, especially in art, luxury items, or anything that adds beauty and value to our lives. It's also important to note that the energy of this transit extends beyond personal matters. Venus in Libra has a strong influence on social dynamics and collective consciousness. During this period, there may be a heightened focus on diplomacy, fairness, and justice on a broader scale. People may be more inclined toward peaceful negotiations, finding common ground, and working together for the greater good. This is a favorable time for resolving disputes, whether in personal relationships, workplaces, or on a larger societal level. The energy of Venus and Libra promotes unity, cooperation, and the idea that we are all interconnected. However, as we welcome this harmonious transit, it's worth mentioning the immediate astrological events surrounding it. When Venus enters Libra, there will be a partial lunar eclipse in Pisces on September 18th. Eclipses are known for their intense and transformative energies, often bringing sudden changes, revelations, or shifts in consciousness. The days following the eclipse may feel a bit sensitive or uncertain, so it's advisable to approach this time with caution and mindfulness. While Venus in Libra offers the promise of restoration and balance, the eclipse energy suggests that we may need to navigate through some emotional or spiritual turbulence before fully experiencing the benefits of this transit. 
Despite the potential intensity of the eclipse, Venus's presence in Libra acts as a soothing balm, helping us to regain our footing and move forward with grace and poise. This transit invites us to embrace the qualities of Venus and Libra, diplomacy, fairness, and the pursuit of beauty and harmony. It's an ideal time to focus on self-care, to cultivate loving and supportive relationships, and to create a more balanced and beautiful life. Whether it's through engaging in artistic pursuits, enhancing your living space, or simply spending quality time with loved ones, this is a period to indulge in the pleasures that life has to offer. Venus represents love and activities that bring joy. As Venus transits through different houses for approximately 25 days, it signifies an increased inclination towards activities associated with that specific house. The final outcomes may vary based on the dignity of Venus in the birth chart, but the common thread is an affinity towards engagements related to the house Venus is currently transiting. Venus primarily influences the Moon and Mercury and is relatively susceptible to the influence of malefic planets such as the Sun, Mars, Saturn, Rahu, and Ketu. To accurately assess the impact of these transits, it is crucial to consider your Ascendant and Moon signs. The Ascendant sign offers insights into the timing of life events, while the Moon sign reveals how you will emotionally respond to these changes. Take into account the position of your current Mahadasha Lord in your birth chart, as it can shed light on how these transits will influence the recurring themes of your current Dasha period. This transit may manifest differently for each individual, and how they navigate this transit will depend on their personal charts. A more precise understanding of the impact of this transit can be gained by examining Venus's Ashtaka Varga score in Libra. Keep in mind that the effects of this transit are contingent on Venus's interaction with the planets in individual birth charts. It's also worth noting that individuals currently experiencing the influence of Venus Dasha may feel the effects of this transit more intensely. To understand how this transit may affect you based on your zodiac sign and the houses it transits, let's delve into those specifics. For Aries, Venus, the ruler of your second and seventh houses, will move into your seventh house of relationships, partnerships, and public engagements. This shift marks a pivotal moment, particularly because Venus has recently been debilitated and conjunct with Ketu in Virgo. As Venus enters Libra, its own sign, it brings harmony, beauty, and balance to various aspects of your life, especially in relationships and professional partnerships. The seventh house governs all kinds of partnerships, whether romantic, business, or social. With Venus transiting through this house, there is a heightened focus on relationships. You may find that your one-on-one -on -one connections are illuminated, and the importance of harmony and cooperation becomes evident. If you're married or in a committed relationship, expect a deepening of emotional bonds, but also be cautious of potential conflicts. Although love and passion will thrive, disputes might arise due to misunderstandings or emotional outbursts. It's essential to nurture emotional understanding to maintain harmony. For those who are single, this period brings a favorable window for new relationships. Venus, being the planet of love and beauty, makes it an excellent time to meet potential partners or solidify existing relationships. However, rushing into love marriages without proper consideration may not yield the desired results. Therefore, while it's a good time for dating or relationship building, patience and emotional balance will be crucial for long-term success. In business, the seventh house also signifies professional partnerships. You may form new alliances or collaborations during this period. Negotiation and compromise are key. Whether it's with a business partner or colleagues, you'll need to navigate your professional relationships with tact, ensuring that you foster cooperation rather than competition. This is a time when successful teamwork can bring prosperity, but conflicts in the workplace must be handled delicately to avoid damaging your professional reputation. Venus. As the ruler of your second house of wealth and seventh house of partnerships will enhance your professional life. You can expect blessings in your career, with potential promotions, recognition, and even new job opportunities. Since Libra is Venus's mool tricon sign, it imbues this transit with strength, suggesting that you will experience financial growth and career advancements during this time. However, it's important to remain cautious. While Venus fosters a supportive environment for professional success, impulsive behavior or arguments with colleagues could hinder progress. Focus on maintaining a calm and balanced demeanor at the workplace. Respecting authority figures and fostering good relationships with colleagues, particularly women, will ensure continued professional success. This transit also encourages you to evaluate your partnerships in business. 
whether forming new collaborations or working with existing partners, this is a time to strengthen bonds through mutual understanding and respect. Learning the art of compromise and negotiation will be crucial. Business ventures may flourish during this time, leading to gains and stability. Financial benefits will likely follow successful professional ventures, but only if conflicts are avoided. Health is another area that requires attention during this transit. Known for your fiery nature, you may experience physical and emotional strain. It's important to adopt a healthy lifestyle, paying attention to both diet and exercise. Venus governs comfort and luxury, so you may feel tempted to indulge in unhealthy habits, but moderation is key. The recent venus k conjunction in Virgo might have brought health challenges, particularly in terms of stress or disruptions in daily routines. With Venus moving into Libra, these challenges will begin to ease, and there will be opportunities to restore balance and health. Focus on maintaining a regular schedule, including mindful practices such as meditation or yoga, to keep your physical and emotional health in check. Venus's transit through the seventh house is about finding equilibrium between personal desires and the needs of others. You may need to take a step back and focus on the dynamics of your relationships. This is a time for introspection, asking yourself whether you are giving enough in your relationships or taking too much. Married couples might experience both joyous moments and challenges. While love will be present, disputes could arise if either partner feels neglected or misunderstood you'll need to make an extra effort to ensure emotional balance and communication. Spending quality time with your partner, going on vacations, or simply engaging in meaningful conversations will help in bringing warmth and harmony to your relationships. This is also a period where you may reconsider the dynamics of your friendships and social circles. Venus in the seventh house encourages inclusivity, beauty, and peace in interactions, so focusing on harmonious relationships with others will greatly enhance your personal life. With Venus moving into its own sign, you can expect an increase in daily income and financial prosperity. This is a great time to finalize deals, invest wisely, and seek opportunities that enhance long-term financial security. Business owners may see profits rise, and working professionals could receive bonuses, raises, or other financial benefits. However, caution must be taken not to overspend on luxuries or make impulsive purchases. Venus can sometimes tempt indulgence, so focus on financial discipline while enjoying the fruits of your labor. Overall, Venus's transit through Libra offers you a period of growth, prosperity, and emotional fulfillment. Relationships, both personal and professional, will take center stage, with the potential for love, harmony, and cooperation. However, challenges in maintaining balance and avoiding conflicts will require careful attention. Health, financial growth, and professional success are all on the horizon, but only if you can master the art of compromise and keep impulsiveness in check. By embracing the positive energy of Venus and Libra, you can enhance your personal and professional life in meaningful ways, ensuring long-term happiness and stability. For Taurus, the transit of Venus into Libra holds significant implications as Venus governs both your first and sixth houses. Venus, symbolizing love, beauty, and harmony is in its own sign of Libra, emphasizing balance and refinement in all areas of life. However, as it moves through your sixth house, which governs health, daily routines, work relationships, and adversaries, this transit brings a mix of positive and challenging influences. As Venus transits your sixth house, health becomes a critical focus. This house relates to health, diseases, and daily routines, so this transit emphasizes the need for self-care and maintaining a balanced lifestyle. You may feel more inclined to adopt healthier habits, be it through exercise, diet, or holistic wellness practices. It's important to stay vigilant about any pre-existing health conditions, as old ailments may resurface. Stress from personal and professional life may also impact your well-being, so maintaining mental and emotional balance is crucial. Acts of service, such as caring for pets or participating in volunteer work, can provide emotional fulfillment and a sense of purpose, enhancing your overall well-being. This transit encourages you to streamline your daily routines, Focusing on work-life balance and setting clear priorities will help you navigate the stress that may arise from work or interpersonal issues. It's also essential to avoid overindulgence during this time, whether in terms of food, luxuries, or physical pleasures. The sixth house can sometimes bring an overfocus on self-gratification, which, if unchecked, could lead to laziness or a loss of motivation. Staying disciplined and organized in both personal and professional spheres will be key to navigating this period successfully. In your professional life, the sixth house governs work environments, colleagues, and competition. 
This transit may bring challenges in the form of ego clashes with coworkers or business partners. You should be cautious in your professional dealings, as rivals and opponents may become more active during this period, potentially working to undermine your efforts. It's important to maintain composure and avoid getting into conflicts, especially over minor issues, as this could escalate tensions unnecessarily. Business professionals should avoid taking financial risks during this transit, particularly with loans or large expenditures, as Venus in the sixth house can indicate financial instability or unexpected expenses. Saving money and avoiding unnecessary spending will help maintain financial balance. If you're employed, this period may not yield the professional results you expect, leading to frustration or dissatisfaction. However, maintaining discipline and focusing on improving your work environment through harmonious relationships with colleagues will be essential. Developing negotiation skills and being open to compromise can help smooth over any rough patches in professional partnerships. Despite these challenges, there will be opportunities for growth and progress in certain professions. If you work in industries related to Venus, such as fashion, beauty, luxury goods, public relations, or creative arts, you may see success if you focus on improving your craft and building harmonious work relationships. You may also experience benefits in fields like banking, health, fitness, or loan departments. This is a time to reconcile ongoing issues gracefully. The sixth house is often a difficult placement for Venus when it comes to relationships, as this house is associated with conflicts, enemies, and disagreements. For you, this transit may strain marital and romantic relationships. There could be disagreements or ego clashes with your spouse, possibly due to differences in opinions or newly imposed rules within the relationship. It will be essential to focus on improving communication and understanding during this time. Working through disagreements with patience and compromise will be necessary to prevent long-term damage to the relationship. If you're married, you may experience moments of tension or dissatisfaction, particularly if you feel your needs aren't being met. It's important to avoid letting external pressures or frustrations from other areas of life spill over into personal relationships. Instead, use this transit to reflect on your needs and responsibilities within the partnership. By focusing on self-improvement and bettering your relationship through acts of kindness and understanding, you can mitigate some of the negative effects of this transit. If you're single, this may not be the best time to pursue new relationships, as the sixth house can bring obstacles and difficulties in forming meaningful connections. However, this transit is an excellent opportunity for personal growth and focusing on self-care, allowing you to better prepare for future relationships. You may face financial challenges during this Venus transit, particularly in the form of unexpected expenses. This transit may disturb your savings and lead to a feeling of financial instability. It's advisable to avoid taking on new loans or making large purchases during this period, as the potential for financial strain is heightened. Instead, focus on budgeting and cutting down on unnecessary expenditures to maintain financial health. On the positive side, there are indications of benefits from foreign travels or associations. If you're involved in international business or planning foreign trips, you may receive gains from these ventures, which can offset some financial challenges faced in other areas. However, careful planning and moderation will be essential to ensuring these opportunities lead to long-term benefits. Overall, Venus's transit through Libra in your sixth house brings mixed blessings. While there will be challenges in personal relationships, health, and finances, there is also room for growth and progress, especially in work-related matters. The key to navigating this transit successfully lies in maintaining discipline, focusing on self-care, and striving for harmony in all interactions. By avoiding overindulgence, staying vigilant in professional dealings, and nurturing personal relationships, you can emerge from this period with a stronger sense of balance, and well-being. For Gemini individuals, the transit of Venus into Libra will significantly impact you as it occupies your fifth house, which governs creativity, romance, children, and speculative ventures. Venus, being the lord of both the fifth and twelfth houses, brings a combination of harmony and challenges. As this transit unfolds, you are likely to experience a resurgence of passion, inspiration, and opportunities in both your personal and professional lives. During this period, Venus transiting the fifth house ignites creativity and artistic expression. This is a time when you may feel an overwhelming urge to explore your creative potential, whether through art, music, writing, or any other form of self-expression. The inspiration you've been lacking in recent weeks is likely to return in full force. If you have felt disconnected from your passions or stuck in a creative rut, you now have the opportunity to rediscover your inner child finding joy in activities that allow for self-expression. For artists, performers, 
or anyone involved in creative professions, this transit is highly favorable. Your work will receive recognition and appreciation, and you may even get unexpected opportunities to showcase your talents. The alignment of Venus and Libra, a sign associated with beauty and harmony, adds a magical touch to your creative pursuits, allowing you to create with ease and grace. Venus rules over love and relationships, and its transit through the fifth house brings renewed energy to your romantic relationships. This is a period marked by joy, affection, and a deepening of emotional bonds. If you are single, this transit opens up the possibility of new romantic connections. Your personal magnetism will be at its peak, and you may attract a partner who shares your interests and values. For those already in relationships, this is a time of rekindling passion. Any misunderstandings or issues that have arisen in the past few months can now be resolved with ease, as Venus brings a sense of harmony and understanding into your relationship. Romantic moments, meaningful conversations, and shared experiences will strengthen your bond with your partner. This period is especially beneficial for couples trying to conceive, as the fifth house also rules children, making it a favorable time for family planning. On the professional front, Venus's transit in Libra promises a period of progress and success. If you are engaged in careers related to the arts, entertainment, education, and speculative ventures like the stock market, you will see remarkable gains. Venus's influence will bring opportunities for recognition and monetary rewards in your professional endeavors. You might find yourself excelling in areas that require creativity, innovation, or public interaction. Speculative investments, especially in the stock market, are likely to yield significant returns during this transit. If you have been considering making financial investments or taking risks in speculative areas, this period is favorable. However, it's essential to approach these opportunities with caution, as Venus's connection with the 12th house suggests that some investments could lead to unexpected expenditures. Therefore, while gains are likely, managing your finances with care will be crucial to avoid unnecessary losses. Venus also governs the 12th house for Gemini, which rules over loss, expenses, and past baggage. As Venus transits the fifth house, there will be a sense of closure and resolution regarding unresolved issues from the past, particularly in romantic relationships and personal matters. If you have been dealing with a breakup or emotional turmoil, this transit brings healing and a fresh perspective. It is likely that you will feel emotionally lighter, allowing you to move on from past difficulties. For those who have experienced a breakup recently, there is a strong possibility that reconciliation could occur during this transit. Venus in the fifth house encourages forgiveness, understanding, and second chances. The energy of Libra, being a sign of balance and harmony, will support you in resolving any lingering conflicts with grace. The fifth house also represents children, and Venus's transit brings a harmonious influence in this area. As a parent, you will find joy in spending time with your children and engaging in activities that foster a strong emotional connection. Children will bring happiness, and this period may also mark milestones or achievements in their lives. Venus's transit in the fifth house also positively impacts your physical and mental well-being. You will experience a renewed sense of vitality and energy during this period. Health issues that may have been troubling you in the past will begin to subside, allowing you to feel more physically fit and mentally balanced. This is an excellent time to focus on activities that bring joy and relaxation, as Venus encourages you to nurture yourself and prioritize self-care. Venus's rulership on the 12th house means that any subconscious fears or anxieties that have been weighing you down will now be addressed. Meditation, yoga, and other spiritual practices may be especially beneficial during this time, helping you align your mind and body. While this transit brings many positive developments, it's important to remain cautious in certain areas. Venus's connection with the 12th house suggests that there may be hidden rivals or adversaries who could attempt to undermine your success. It's essential to stay vigilant, especially in professional settings, and not to take your success for granted. While financial gains are likely, there is also the potential for unexpected expenses. Venus as the ruler of 12th house indicates that indulgent spending could lead to financial strain if not managed properly. Therefore, it's important to keep a close eye on your budget and avoid unnecessary extravagances. Overall, Venus's transit through Libra in the fifth house brings a wealth of opportunities for you. From creative expression and romantic fulfillment to professional gains and improved health, this period is filled with positive energy. However, it's important to remain cautious of potential rivals and manage your finances carefully to avoid unnecessary losses. By embracing the creative, joyful, and harmonious energy of Venus, you can make the most of this transit and experience personal and professional growth. 
For Cancer, the transit of Venus through Libra in your fourth house brings a time of heightened focus on emotional security, home, family, and personal happiness. Venus rules both the fourth and eleventh houses for Cancer, so this transit influences not just your domestic sphere but also the fulfillment of desires, social connections, and financial gains. Venus in Libra, its own sign, is a dignified and auspicious placement, providing a supportive atmosphere for growth and harmony in both personal and professional areas. However, there are also some areas where caution is needed, particularly in terms of professional rivalry and health. Venus's presence in your fourth house will make home and family a central focus during this transit. You may feel a strong urge to beautify your living space, which could manifest in a desire to redecorate, renovate, or make significant home improvements. Whether it's investing in new furniture, luxurious items, or even purchasing a new vehicle, there will be a focus on increasing comfort and creating a peaceful sanctuary at home. You may also consider real estate investments, as the stars align favorably for purchasing property or a new home during this period. The emotional bonds within your family, especially with your mother, will be strengthened. Family members will spend quality time together, engaging in activities that foster love and unity. This is a time when you may also host gatherings or celebrations at home, bringing happiness to your domestic environment. Venus's transit supports harmony and emotional satisfaction, nurturing deeper connections and creating a more tranquil home life. Venus as the 11th house lord also governs financial gains and the fulfillment of desires. The transit through your fourth house indicates that financial stability will be enhanced, particularly through home-related ventures or investments. You may find yourself spending on luxury items, whether for the home or yourself, but this expenditure will be met with increased financial security. The money spent will bring joy and a sense of accomplishment, and any lingering financial concerns from the past will be resolved during this period. If you work in industries related to home decor, interior design, real estate, or luxury items, this transit will be particularly favorable. There is also a high likelihood of financial windfalls, unexpected gains, or opportunities to increase wealth, especially for those involved in creative or home-based businesses. While the transit brings harmony on the home front, it also highlights some challenges in professional life. Venus's dignified placement boosts earnings and professional gains, but it also activates professional rivals. You should be cautious of colleagues who may try to undermine your success. Workplace politics and competition might intensify, and it's crucial to maintain vigilance in relationships with coworkers to avoid turning potential allies into rivals. Your charm and diplomatic skills will help you navigate professional conflicts. However, it's important to avoid any irresponsible behavior or miscommunication that could escalate tensions at work. Working in collaboration and building trust with coworkers will be key to overcoming challenges during this period. The good news is that despite these professional obstacles, you will still achieve success and meet your career goals with the help of supportive colleagues and your own perseverance. Health is another area that requires attention during this transit. Venus's placement can bring some physical indulgence, which may lead to health concerns if not monitored carefully. It's a good time for you to focus on self-care and avoid overindulgence in food or luxury that could affect your well-being. The transit suggests paying attention to the health of family members, particularly your mother. While no severe health issues are indicated, maintaining a balanced lifestyle and addressing any minor concerns promptly will ensure overall well-being. With Venus being the ruler of the 11th house of desires and social circles, its transit in the 4th house of home and heart brings a beautiful synergy. This is a time when you will find that your deepest desires, particularly those related to family life, personal comfort, and emotional well-being, come to fruition. Venus in Libra promotes harmony, love, and abundance, making this an ideal time for manifestation practices. Whether through affirmations, visualizations, or simply focusing on positive emotions, you will find that the things you long for start to manifest in your life. This is also an excellent period for nurturing friendships and social connections that bring joy and emotional security. People who share your values and interests will gravitate toward you, creating an atmosphere of mutual support and love. You will feel more connected to your emotional needs and will be able to attract people and situations that fulfill those needs during this time. Overall, Venus's transit through Libra in your fourth house offers a period of emotional fulfillment, financial stability, and the strengthening of personal relationships. Home life will flourish, with opportunities to improve the living environment, deepen family bonds, and achieve personal desires. The harmonious energy of Venus will help transform any past insecurities into newfound confidence and fulfillment, allowing you to enjoy the best that life has to offer during this period.
For Leo, the transit of Venus into Libra, which rules both your third and tenth houses, activates your third house. This marks a phase of enhanced communication, networking, creativity, and professional success. The third house, associated with siblings, courage, short-distance travel, and self-expression, will be a focal point, leading to dynamic shifts in both your personal and professional life. As Venus enters your third house, you can expect a noticeable boost in your communication skills and social interactions. This transit sparks a desire for engaging in meaningful conversations with those around you, especially siblings and close relatives. Whether through stimulating intellectual exchanges or lighthearted banter, your communication will carry an extra charm and persuasiveness. This is an ideal time for you to pitch ideas, make presentations, or engage in negotiations at work. Your words will have a magnetic pull, making it easier to influence others or win them over to your point of view. This transit opens doors for enhancing your social network. Whether through business or personal connections, you'll find yourself drawn to like-minded individuals who can support your ambitions. Networking efforts are likely to bear fruit, particularly in professional circles, where your charm and eloquence will leave a lasting impression on colleagues and superiors. Expanding your social circle will lead to greater opportunities and possibly even public recognition. Venus, the ruler of your 10th house of career, transiting through the third house, is particularly beneficial if you work in creative fields like content creation, graphic design, media, marketing, or sales. This period enhances your self-expression and boosts your creative instincts, making it a great time to showcase your talents on social media or other public platforms. You should capitalize on this energy by launching new projects, creating innovative content, or improving your brand visibility. This is also a favorable time for artists and performers, as the third house relates to performing arts and skills, allowing you to shine in your chosen field. However, caution is advised when contemplating major professional changes during this time. While success is indicated in your current endeavors, switching jobs or making drastic career moves may not be favorable. Instead, focus on strengthening your existing position by leveraging your improved communication skills and forging stronger relationships with colleagues and superiors. The third house in Vedic astrology is also associated with bravery, willpower, and determination. Venus in this house amplifies these qualities, allowing you to face challenges with confidence. Whether it's overcoming personal struggles or professional obstacles, this transit ensures that you'll possess the courage and mental fortitude to come out victorious. Enemies or competitors won't be able to defeat you easily, and you'll find success in areas where you exhibit determination and focus. If you're working in the government sector, you may see significant profits and achievements during this transit. One of the most important aspects of this transit is its effect on your sibling relationships. Venus's influence brings harmony, mutual respect, and understanding to your bond with siblings. If there have been any past misunderstandings or conflicts, this is an excellent time to resolve them through open and honest communication. A sense of camaraderie and support will prevail, making this a period of peace and cooperation within your family. For those of you with strained relationships with siblings, this transit provides an opportunity for healing and reconciliation. If you're single, Venus's presence in the third house brings opportunities for romance. This transit enhances your allure, making you more attractive to potential partners. New romantic connections are likely to develop during this period, and there's a good chance that such relationships could lead to long-term commitments, possibly even marriage in the future. If you've been looking for a partner, this is a favorable time to put yourself out there and explore romantic possibilities. However, if you're married, caution is needed during this transit. The heightened influence of Venus may introduce the temptation of extramarital affairs, which could bring complications and potentially damage your relationship with your spouse. It's crucial to maintain transparency and avoid actions that could lead to misunderstandings or trust issues in your marriage. Maintaining open communication and avoiding ego-driven conflicts will help preserve harmony in your personal life. Venus's transit through the third house also brings a desire for short trips and luxurious travels. This is a great time to embark on weekend getaways or short-distance journeys, which are likely to be filled with enjoyment and relaxation. Travel during this time will not only provide a much-needed break but may also offer new perspectives and opportunities for personal and professional growth. Since Venus also rules your 10th house of career, you'll benefit financially from your professional endeavors. After a period of uncertainty or stagnation, especially when Venus was debilitated in your second house and conjunct K2, you will now start seeing improvements in your financial situation. Whether through successful ventures, increased business profits, or support from influential people in your network, monetary gains are indicated. This transit may also bring opportunities for sponsorship, partnership, 
or funding, particularly if you work in creative or business-oriented fields. During this time, you'll find that people around you are more supportive. Whether it's family members, colleagues, or friends, this is a period when others will go out of their way to offer help, advice, or emotional support. In return, your interactions with others will also be marked by empathy, understanding, and mutual respect. Overall, the transit of Venus into Libra in your third house is a period of growth, success, and improved communication. Professionally, this transit brings opportunities for networking, creativity, and financial gain, but caution is advised regarding major career changes. On the personal front, relationships with siblings and loved ones will flourish, while singles may find romantic opportunities. With increased courage, determination, and communication skills, this is an excellent time for you to advance in all areas of life, but be mindful of maintaining balance and avoiding ego-driven conflicts. For Virgo, the transit of Venus into Libra, where it rules both your second house of wealth and family and the ninth house of fortune and spiritual pursuits, is a transformative period with a focus on material gains, family relationships, and personal growth. When Venus transits through your second house, it brings an energy that enhances financial stability, promotes harmonious interactions, and strengthens familial bonds. Venus transiting your second house, which governs wealth, assets, and family, emphasizes material abundance. This is a favorable time for reviewing finances, reassessing budgets, and making wise investment choices. Whether it's real estate, stocks, or other forms of financial planning, this period is opportune for shuffling assets and optimizing returns. Since Venus also rules your ninth house of fortune and long-distance endeavors, you might see gains through foreign connections or real estate investments. However, it is essential to approach financial opportunities with caution and thoughtful planning to avoid impulsive decisions. In addition to growing wealth, you can expect a smooth cash flow, making you feel secure and content. Savings are likely to increase, and there could be unexpected financial windfalls, either through personal endeavors or family-related opportunities. This might be a time when you make luxury purchases, especially in precious metals like gold or silver, further contributing to your financial stability. However, exercise moderation, ensuring you don't overindulge in material desires. The second house also represents family and speech, and Venus in Libra brings peace, harmony, and happiness into your domestic life. Family gatherings and events will be sources of joy and connection, with relatives, particularly siblings and elders, offering support and encouragement. It's a time of socializing and enjoying the simple pleasures of life, whether through family dinners, celebrations, or casual get-togethers. You may host or attend luxurious events, creating opportunities to strengthen relationships with both immediate family and extended relatives. If you've faced any past misunderstandings or conflicts with family, this transit offers an excellent chance for reconciliation. Venus's harmonious energy will smooth over any tensions, fostering an atmosphere of mutual understanding and respect. For expecting couples, this period may bring new additions to the family, bringing joy and fulfillment. Venus in the second house boosts your ability to communicate eloquently and persuasively. Whether in personal or professional settings, this is a time when your words will carry weight, helping you navigate challenging conversations and impress others. This transit enhances diplomacy and tact, enabling you to foster more harmonious relationships with colleagues, friends, and family members. If you're involved in negotiations or business dealings, your ability to articulate ideas clearly and effectively will prove invaluable, leading to successful outcomes. Students and individuals preparing for competitive exams will also see improvements in their performance. The supportive energy of Venus in the second house increases focus and creativity, aiding in academic endeavors and competitions. Mentors, especially fathers or father-like figures, will offer blessings and guidance during this period, contributing to your success and personal growth. While Venus's transit through your second house brings moderate gains in professional life, the emphasis is more on financial stability than rapid career advancements. This is not necessarily a time for significant professional changes, but rather for building a solid foundation and reaping the rewards of previous efforts. For those whose careers are linked to Venusian industries, such as fashion, beauty, art, luxury goods, or event management, this transit brings favorable opportunities. You'll benefit from an increased demand for your skills and services, leading to higher income and recognition. Venus's rulership over the ninth house suggests that if you're working in fields connected to foreign trade, legal matters, or higher education, you may experience new opportunities or support from overseas connections. However, it's wise to be cautious with investments in new projects and avoid risky ventures. 
Instead, focus on consolidating gains, fostering good relations with colleagues, and maintaining steady progress in your career. Venus is the planet of love and relationships, and its transit through your second house brings warmth and affection to personal relationships. If you're in a committed relationship, you'll enjoy a harmonious period filled with mutual understanding and emotional connection. Family life will flourish, with an emphasis on shared values and creating a comfortable, nurturing environment for loved ones. If any tensions have arisen in the past, this transit offers the chance for healing and renewal in relationships. If you're single, you may find yourself drawn to potential partners, especially in social settings such as family gatherings or events. For those looking for long-term commitment, this transit may bring opportunities for new romantic relationships that have the potential to lead to marriage. Venus's influence makes you more attractive and charming, increasing your chances of forming meaningful and lasting connections. Lastly, Venus's rulership over the ninth house of spirituality and higher knowledge encourages you to cultivate a sense of gratitude and appreciation for the blessings in your life. Whether through religious ceremonies, family rituals, or personal reflection, this period is ideal for nurturing spiritual connections and embracing the simple pleasures of life. You may feel a stronger connection to your higher purpose, finding joy in both material success and emotional fulfillment. Overall, Venus's transit through Libra in your second house brings financial stability, family harmony, and opportunities for personal and professional growth. This period is marked by an enhanced sense of well-being, both in terms of material gains and emotional fulfillment, making it a time to appreciate and nurture the blessings in life. For Libra, you can expect a time of personal magnetism, self-love, and professional growth as Venus, the planet of love, beauty, and harmony transits into your sign. This transit, taking place in your first house, focuses on the self, physical appearance, and overall well-being, offering a period of self-improvement and enhancement in various aspects of life. During this period, you will feel a stronger connection to your own physical appearance and self-expression. Venus's placement in the first house encourages you to focus on grooming, updating your style, and paying extra attention to your attractiveness. This transit makes you more amiable and pleasant in your interactions, increasing your social magnetism. People will naturally be drawn to you, making it an excellent time for networking, forming new relationships, or even rekindling old ones. Whether through physical transformation or renewed confidence, this is a unique opportunity to present yourself in the best possible light. Although Venus brings vitality and charm, caution is advised regarding indulgence, particularly in food. You may feel tempted to indulge in fine cuisine, luxurious habits, or unhealthy eating patterns, which could impact your health negatively. It is essential to adopt a balanced approach, focusing on fitness routines that can enhance both your physical and mental well-being. Venus's influence in the first house encourages self-care, but overindulgence should be avoided to maintain optimal health. Remember, moderation is key during this period. Professionally, Venus's dignified position in Libra will support your career growth and financial opportunities. Those involved in creative industries or professions related to beauty, luxury goods, or artistic endeavors will especially benefit. Business people and entrepreneurs are likely to see a surge in profits, especially if your ventures involve luxury items, fashion, or cosmetics. Venus's transit through Libra also boosts negotiation skills, allowing you to secure lucrative deals. This is a time when your diplomatic nature will shine, helping to smooth over professional rivalries and competition. If you're in a public-facing role or leadership position, you'll notice a positive shift in your professional life. If past ventures have been stalled, this period will bring a release from those constraints. With Venus ruling both your first and eighth houses, there may also be an element of transformation in your professional path, leading to the successful initiation of new projects or partnerships. Though Venus's transit is mostly beneficial, caution is advised when dealing with rivals. Venus, as your eighth house lord, brings hidden challenges and competition to the forefront. While you may successfully fend off adversaries, it is essential to stay vigilant and maintain good relationships with colleagues and peers. Venus may bring social charm, but any hint of arrogance or overconfidence could lead to misunderstandings in professional settings. Balancing self-confidence with humility will ensure that your personal and professional relationships remain harmonious. On the personal front, Venus's transit through the first house signifies a period of heightened romance and attraction. Existing relationships will experience a deepening of emotional bonds, and there will be opportunities to take these relationships to the next level, such as engagement or marriage. For those who are single, this is an opportune time for new romantic encounters, 
as your enhanced charm will naturally draw others in. However, be mindful of hidden elements or transformations occurring in relationships due to Venus's rulership over the eighth house. Avoid being too controlling or overly indulgent in desires, as this could lead to tension. This transit is also favorable for family life. You will enjoy quality time with loved ones, and there may be important family gatherings or celebrations. This period will also bring a sense of peace and contentment within the home, especially if you've been feeling disconnected or isolated in recent weeks. As Venus rules the eighth house of transformation, hidden matters, and spiritual growth, you may experience deeper self-awareness and spiritual insights during this time. The challenges that arose when Venus was debilitated in Virgo, such as feelings of insecurity or confusion, will give way to a renewed sense of purpose and clarity. If you're spiritually inclined, you may find yourself drawn to meditation, yoga, or other practices that promote inner peace and self-reflection. This transit brings a greater understanding of life's mysteries, including topics like life and death, transformation, and transcendence. The Eighth House influence invites you to explore these deeper aspects of existence, and you may experience significant personal growth as a result. Overall, Venus's transit through Libra marks a highly favorable period for self-improvement, professional success, and personal relationships. You will find yourself more attractive, confident, and socially active, which will translate into success in both personal and professional spheres. This period brings harmony and balance, helping you enhance your physical appearance, improve your health, and deepen your relationships. With Venus's support, the challenges of the past will give way to a more optimistic and fulfilling future. As long as moderation and vigilance are maintained, this transit promises to bring you a step closer to your goals and aspirations. For Scorpio, when Venus, the lord of your 7th and 12th houses, transits your 12th house, it brings a blend of spiritual introspection, self-reflection, and a focus on relationships. However, it also raises the potential for indulgence in material pleasures and escapism. This transit can enhance various aspects of your life, including professional opportunities from overseas, personal relationships, and inner transformation. Still, certain challenges may arise that require careful management, particularly in relationships and finances. As Venus transits your 12th house, it encourages you to look inward, fostering a desire for solitude and spiritual exploration. This period is ideal for introspection, self-healing, and retreating from the noise of daily life. You may feel drawn to spiritual practices like meditation, yoga, or spending time in nature. The 12th house often represents seclusion and a connection to higher realms, making this a great time for contemplative practices or spiritual retreats. You might also experience heightened empathy and compassion, leading you to engage in charitable or service-oriented activities behind the scenes. During this period, your spiritual evolution can be heightened, allowing you to transcend material attachments more easily. However, be mindful of the potential for escapism, whether through indulgence in luxury, substances, or unhealthy habits. It's essential to find a healthy balance between enjoying life's pleasures and avoiding excess. This phase could inspire artistic and creative pursuits, allowing you to channel your introspective energies into meaningful activities such as music, writing, or other forms of art. Venus in the 12th house also brings potential monetary gains from foreign sources or international collaborations. This is a favorable time to explore business opportunities abroad, make foreign investments, or consider partnerships with people from different cultural backgrounds. If you work in fields related to travel, imports, or international business, you may see significant financial rewards. Business trips and travels to luxurious destinations may also be in the cards. However, be cautious about balancing spending and saving during this transit, as the 12th house governs expenses. Despite increased expenditures, your overall wealth may grow, contributing to financial success. While professional success from overseas ventures is likely, it's crucial to remain vigilant and systematic in your work. Strategic planning and disciplined efforts will help you capitalize on the opportunities that arise. This transit may signal the conclusion of a long-standing project or the beginning of new ventures. You may also feel inclined to work behind the scenes, focusing on personal or professional matters more privately. On the relationship front, Venus's transit through your 12th house can bring both harmonious and challenging energies. Married life is likely to flourish, with increased intimacy and connection between you and your partner. You may experience a deepening emotional bond and a stronger understanding within your relationship. However, be cautious of the potential for secretive or hidden relationships, as the 12th house's influence can tempt you toward dishonesty. Avoid morally questionable activities that could jeopardize trust in your relationship. 
The dreamy nature of Venus in the 12th house might lead to romantic encounters that feel transcendent or involve individuals from foreign backgrounds. However, these relationships may face challenges, particularly in communication or occasional conflicts. It's important to handle disagreements with care and avoid impulsive or indulgent behavior. While this transit supports emotional depth and compassion, be mindful of maintaining healthy boundaries and emotional integrity in your relationships. Health becomes a focal point during this transit, for both you and your partner. You may experience rejuvenation in your emotional well-being, but it's essential to remain vigilant about potential health concerns. Venus encourages self-care, grooming, and attention to your physical appearance, and you may feel more inclined to invest time in fitness, diet, and overall health. Regular exercise, yoga, and a balanced diet will benefit you, helping you maintain vitality and avoid health issues. Your partner's health may also be affected during this transit, so it's important to provide support where needed. Ensuring that both you and your partner stick to a healthy lifestyle will help mitigate any health challenges that arise. One primary challenge during Venus's transit in your 12th house is the risk of overindulgence in pleasures and escapism. You may feel tempted to indulge in luxury, material comforts, or unhealthy habits like excessive partying, alcohol, or other forms of gratification. While enjoying pleasure is a natural expression of Venus's energy, it's crucial to maintain a sense of moderation. Overindulgence could lead to complications in personal relationships, especially if trust is broken or responsibilities are neglected in favor of short-term gratification. Be aware of the potential consequences of your actions, particularly in matters of passion and desire. The urge to escape reality or avoid dealing with pressing issues could create bigger problems in the future. Mindfulness and self-discipline will be essential during this period. Overall, Venus's transit through your 12th house offers an opportunity for deep introspection, professional growth from overseas ventures, and the potential for enhanced relationships. However, it also brings challenges, especially with indulgence and escapism. This is a time to focus on self-healing, spiritual exploration, and personal growth while remaining mindful of your desires and the impact of your actions on those around you. With balance, discipline, and integrity, this transit can lead to significant progress in both your spiritual and material realms. For Sagittarius, the transit of Venus into its own sign, Libra, brings significant influence. Venus, the ruler of your 6th and 11th houses, transiting the 11th house, highlights themes related to social connections, financial gains, and the realization of long-term aspirations. This transit offers a mix of opportunities and challenges, enhancing your friendships, social networking, and monetary success. When Venus graces your 11th house, the focus shifts towards friendships, social networks, and long-term goals. You will experience an expansion of your social circle. New friendships may form, and existing ones can deepen. You may find yourself at the center of attention, especially among female friends and acquaintances. This transit brings opportunities for collaboration, group activities, and involvement in social causes. Engaging with like-minded people and building community connections becomes your focal point. This is an excellent time to involve yourself in social gatherings, parties, and networking events. However, it's crucial to maintain balance and not get too carried away with the social whirlwind, as there's a tendency to lose grip on other aspects of life during this highly engaging period. One of the most notable aspects of Venus transiting through your 11th house is the potential for financial gains. You are likely to see an increase in your income, possibly from multiple sources. This is an excellent time for those in business or working in fields related to Venus, such as arts, fashion, beauty, and media, as the chances of success and recognition are high. Your hard work in the professional realm will be rewarded, and superiors will be pleased with your efforts. There is a strong indication of success through social connections and networking efforts. For those under Venus Dasha periods, this is a particularly blessed period where efforts may turn into gold, and old dreams and desires find fulfillment. Venus's transit in the 11th house not only brings financial prosperity, but also enhances the romantic and personal aspects of your life. If you're in love, you will experience beautiful moments filled with romance and intimacy. Relationships will be filled with warmth and affection, making this an ideal time to nurture personal bonds. Marital bliss is also indicated during this period, and for those contemplating love marriage, the chances of fulfillment are high. Spending quality time with loved ones will be essential to increase trust and affection in relationships. This period may also introduce new friendships into your life, further enriching your personal connections. However, it's important to remain respectful and considerate towards female figures in your life, 
as they play a significant role during this transit. While Venus is transiting in its dignified state in your 11th house, it's also the lord of your 6th house, which represents daily work ethics, health, and conflicts. The past weeks, with Venus debilitated in the 10th house and conjunct K2, may have presented challenges, especially in professional settings or with female bosses. However, this transit offers a chance for reconciliation and improvement in these areas. If any conflicts or misunderstandings arose during the previous weeks, this is an opportune time to moving forward. The dignified state of Venus now encourages you to embrace cooperation and seek harmony in your work environment and daily routines. The 11th house is the house of gains, wishes, and aspirations. Venus's transit through this house brings a surge of positive energy towards achieving long-held desires and goals. You may find that your efforts in various projects, especially those involving group collaborations, start yielding favorable results. This is an excellent time to pursue aspirations that require the support of a community or involve collective efforts. For those in creative fields, such as performing arts, graphic design, or artistry, this period offers heightened visibility and recognition. The work produced during this time is likely to strike a chord with the audience, leading to professional success and personal satisfaction. While Venus's transit through the 11th house is generally favorable, it is important for you to maintain a balanced approach. Enjoy the social expansion and the financial gains, but also ensure that other aspects of life are not neglected. There's a high likelihood of getting caught up in the whirlwind of social activities, so it's crucial to focus on personal growth and maintaining a grip on life. Being respectful and supportive to female figures, both in personal and professional spheres, will be key to maximizing the benefits of this transit. Engaging in community-focused activities and being open to collaboration can lead to significant progress towards your long-term goals. Volunteering and participating in group efforts can enhance your sense of fulfillment and happiness during this period. Overall, Venus's transit into Libra marks a period of significant social, financial, and personal growth for you. The focus on friendships, monetary gains, and the fulfillment of aspirations creates an atmosphere of positivity and expansion. By navigating this period with a balanced and collaborative approach, you can make the most of the opportunities presented, leading to a phase of contentment and success. For Capricorn, Venus transiting through your 10th house brings significant changes and influences in career, public image, and professional relationships. With Venus in its own sign, Libra, this transit highlights the potential for career growth, public recognition, and opportunities to enhance your reputation. However, this period also comes with challenges that require a balanced and diplomatic approach to ensure a harmonious outcome. Venus governs your 5th and 10th houses, making this transit particularly impactful for your career. As it moves into the 10th house, it becomes highly favorable for professional advancement and public recognition. You may experience increased popularity and a boost in your professional image. This is a time when the charm and diplomacy associated with Venus can be effectively used to improve relationships with superiors, colleagues, and subordinates. If you work in performing arts, creative fields, or professions linked to Venus, such as fashion, beauty, or entertainment, this transit can be especially rewarding. Opportunities for promotions, awards, and acknowledgement of your hard work are on the horizon. Your efforts in your career may finally pay off, leading to increased income and possibly multiple sources of earnings, including benefits from paternal connections or inheritances. Support and blessings from a father figure or senior authority might also play a role in your professional success during this transit. However, it's important to stay grounded and avoid any tendencies toward boasting or seeking excessive attention. While Venus enhances your desire to showcase achievements, maintaining humility and a balanced demeanor will ensure that you utilize this period in the best possible way. Although the temptation to show off may arise, it's crucial to keep it in check to avoid negative consequences. Despite the potential for growth and recognition, this Venus transit may not be entirely smooth for you. As Venus rules both the 5th and 10th houses, career obstacles and dissatisfaction might surface, especially if there's a lack of harmony with colleagues or authority figures. Patience is essential during this time, as sudden professional challenges may require a practical and level-headed approach to navigate successfully. Issues with competitors and dominance in the workplace could lead to frustration. Be cautious of disagreements or power struggles in your professional environment. Maintaining a diplomatic stance and focusing on collaboration rather than competition will help you overcome these hurdles. On a personal level, the transit may bring some discord in relationships, particularly with children or romantic partners. 
misunderstandings or arguments could arise, so it's important to remain patient and polite to avoid causing harm or hurt feelings. Maintaining a practical approach to family matters will ensure peace and stability at home. While Venus transiting the 10th house is primarily focused on your career and public image, it also influences personal relationships. The warmth and charm brought by Venus can enhance romantic connections and marital life if nurtured with care and understanding. However, there may be tensions in love life, so it's essential to stay calm and avoid conflicts over trivial matters. Familial ties have the potential to improve, and this transit could bring opportunities for family trips or deeper connections with loved ones. However, challenges in maintaining harmony at home may arise, requiring you to take a balanced and patient approach. Male Capricorns, in particular, should show respect toward women in their lives to ensure relationships remain supportive and cordial. Amid the professional and personal dynamics of this Venus transit, it's important for you to focus on health and well-being. Practicing meditation can help maintain a relaxed state of mind, enabling you to balance relationships more effectively. With the 10th house also representing your public life and actions, maintaining inner peace will be essential to projecting a positive and composed image to the world. As Venus is a yoga karaka planet for you, it has the power to bring positive results when positioned favorably. The transit of Venus in the 10th house is generally considered as transformative for career, especially now that it has moved past the challenges of debilitation in the 9th house and the conjunction with K2. This shift promises an uplifting phase for your career aspirations, allowing you to make substantial progress in your professional endeavors. This period is particularly favorable if you're involved in fields like trading, stock market activities, performing arts, or any profession requiring you to showcase your talent. With the 5th house representing creativity and talents, and the 10th house providing the platform to display these abilities on a larger scale, you may find this transit to be a supportive phase for achieving your goals and making important connections. Overall, the transit of Venus and Libra through your 10th house brings a mix of opportunities and challenges. While it offers the potential for career advancement, recognition, and an improved public image, it also calls for a careful and practical approach to avoid professional and personal conflicts. By maintaining diplomacy, patience, and a balanced demeanor, you can navigate this transit successfully, reaping the rewards of Venus's influence while mitigating its challenges. For Aquarius, as Venus transits into Libra and moves into your ninth house, it marks a period filled with adventure, spiritual growth, and the pursuit of higher knowledge. Venus rules both your fourth and ninth houses, signifying a time when familial ties, educational pursuits, and travel endeavors take center stage. This transit brings a sense of philosophical inquiry and a desire to explore new territories, both literally and metaphorically. You may find yourself drawn to distant lands, different cultures, and new belief systems, inspiring a journey of both the mind and spirit. During this transit, Venus gracing your ninth house enhances social standing and familial relationships. You may experience an improvement in your social image, gaining respect and recognition within your community. Opportunities for travel with family and friends arise, providing a chance to build stronger bonds and create lasting memories. Engaging in religious or spiritual activities, such as visiting temples or places of worship, could be on the agenda, deepening your connection to faith and spirituality. This period is also favorable for encountering influential people, potentially opening doors to new opportunities. Venus's transit in Libra indicates positive developments on the professional front. Your hard work will be acknowledged and rewarded, especially if you're in government-related fields. However, the help of female colleagues may be essential in navigating these professional opportunities, highlighting the importance of collaboration and support in the workplace. This transit fosters a harmonious work environment where you can benefit from long travels related to professional ventures, leading to fruitful outcomes. The desire for career advancement may drive you to focus and commit to your work, although you should be mindful of distractions stemming from personal commitments. With Venus in your ninth house, there's a strong pull towards higher learning and spiritual exploration. This is an excellent time for you to upgrade your skills, delve into new philosophies, or embark on spiritual journeys. The energy of Venus here inspires a new voyage, whether through literal travel or an inward journey of self-discovery. Engaging with mentors or teachers can provide valuable guidance during this period, offering insights that expand your mind and broaden your perspective. You are encouraged to embrace this time of learning, seek wisdom from various sources, and nurture your spiritual growth. If you've applied for permanent residency in a foreign country, this transit bodes well for you. The possibility of obtaining foreign travel documents is high, and opportunities for business-related travel are promising. 
success, name, fame, prosperity, and health are in store, especially in connection with ventures abroad. If you're working in foreign companies, you may experience promotions or financial gains, and even if you're already settled abroad, you could encounter unexpected financial windfalls. This period is auspicious for making significant progress in international business dealings, fostering prosperity and good fortune. While Venus brings many positive aspects, you should not neglect your health during this time. Minor health issues, particularly related to the back, may arise. It's important to pay attention to these signs and seek appropriate care to prevent them from becoming more serious. Practicing yoga and meditation can help maintain balance and well-being, ensuring that your physical health does not detract from the overall positive experiences of this transit. Venus, being a yoga karaka for you, emerges from its previous affliction during its debilitation in the 8th house and conjunction with Ketu. Now, as it moves into the dignified position of your 9th house, it brings a surge of uplifting energy. This transition aligns with the timing of a lunar eclipse, symbolizing a tumultuous yet ultimately beneficial surge of energy. You may experience sudden epiphanies or realizations, guided by mentors or influential figures. Goals and plans that previously seemed stalled may suddenly find the momentum needed to take off, turning the tide in your favor. The presence of Venus, governing finance, relationships, and pleasure, brings a renewed sense of joy and fulfillment in various aspects of your life. If you've been struggling with inner emotional turmoil, this transit offers a chance to emerge from those struggles. Whether it's through the arrival of a guiding figure or the realization of long-held dreams, this period provides an opportunity for emotional healing and growth. Venus in your ninth house encourages you to look beyond immediate concerns and seek a broader, more expansive perspective on life. This can lead to a sense of peace and contentment, as you find yourself more aligned with your true purpose and aspirations. Overall, the transit of Venus through Libra in your ninth house is a period of significant growth and expansion. It brings opportunities for career advancement, social recognition, and spiritual exploration. Travel, learning, and meaningful interactions with mentors play a crucial role in this journey. While there are many positive aspects, maintaining your health and balancing personal and professional commitments will be key to fully benefiting from this transit. As Venus moves into this favorable position, embrace the opportunities for growth, both in the outer world and within yourself. For Pisces, as Venus transits into Libra, moving into your eighth house, this period brings a strong focus on transformation, intimacy, and shared resources. You may feel drawn to deeper emotional connections and explore the hidden aspects of your psyche. This is a time for delving into subjects like psychology, mysticism, or the occult, and it also highlights the importance of research and uncovering hidden truths. Financial matters, particularly related to inheritances or shared assets, could come to the forefront and will require your attention and careful management. The eighth house is associated with themes of transformation, endings, and rebirth. With Venus transiting through this house, you may experience a period of intense personal growth and emotional healing. This is a powerful time for introspection, encouraging you to confront and heal past traumas or emotional wounds. Engaging in practices such as yoga, meditation, or aura healing can support your emotional renewal, helping you cleanse old energy and invite fresh, positive vibrations into your life. In relationships, you might notice significant changes. If you've been experiencing difficulties in your relationships, this transit could intensify those challenges, potentially leading to a separation or emotional distance. However, it also offers an opportunity for deeper emotional intimacy and stronger bonds with others. Approach your relationships with honesty and a willingness to explore new depths of connection. For those of you who are single, this period could introduce new romantic interests, though it's wise to keep these relationships low-key initially, as the eighth house can bring intense energies that require careful handling. On the financial front, Venus in the 8th house can bring monetary gains, especially through joint ventures, inheritances, or investments. Shared resources and partnerships may play a prominent role, and you could benefit from collaborations. There's also the potential for making significant investments, such as purchasing a new vehicle or enhancing your lifestyle. However, exercise caution, make well-thought-out decisions and stay vigilant about your finances, as the 8th house also governs hidden or unexpected aspects of wealth. In your domestic life, you might experience a period of contentment and emotional satisfaction. Quality time with family and loved ones could bring a sense of harmony at home. However, relationships with younger siblings may present a mix of joy and underlying issues that need to be addressed. Communication and understanding are key to maintaining a balanced and loving dynamic with your siblings. 
Despite potential challenges, your overall domestic atmosphere is likely to be positive, filled with opportunities for emotional bonding. Professionally, this transit brings the potential for success and recognition. You may find yourself feeling more confident due to your achievements at work, and there could be opportunities for promotions or acknowledgement. Those of you in government jobs might experience favorable changes, such as transfers or new assignments. Be mindful, however, to maintain a balanced approach when dealing with colleagues and superiors. Venus in Libra enhances your charm and diplomatic skills but also warns against letting ego interfere with professional relationships. Building strong connections with female colleagues can be particularly beneficial during this time. Venus, in its own sign of Libra in the 8th house, indicates material gains and luxury, but caution is necessary. You may find your personal relationships cordial, with opportunities for travel or spending time with loved ones that strengthen emotional bonds. However, it's important to avoid being overly assertive or egoistic in your interactions, as this could cause conflicts. Strive for balance in your behavior and communication, ensuring you remain mindful of your words and actions. Health is another area to watch during this transit. Minor issues may arise, and it's important not to ignore these signs. Addressing health concerns early can prevent them from becoming more serious. Incorporating regular self-care practices and seeking appropriate medical guidance when necessary will help you maintain overall well-being during this period. One key aspect of this transit is transformation in relationships, finances, and spiritual matters. Venus's influence in the 8th house could lead to intense growth, possibly bringing profound changes in your life. This could manifest as a new relationship, a deepening of existing bonds, or even a shift in your spiritual outlook. Embrace this period with an open mind and a willingness to explore new dimensions of yourself. Engage in activities that promote personal growth, whether through learning new skills, spiritual exploration, or diving into the mysteries of life. Overall, Venus's transit through Libra in your eighth house brings a period of transformation, growth, and introspection. It offers opportunities for financial gains, professional success, and deeper emotional connections. By approaching this transit with a balanced, mindful attitude, you can harness its energies for positive change and personal evolution. As we wrap up this transit episode, remember that these insights are based on sidereal or Vedic astrology, which accounts for the approximately 24 degree difference with the tropical zodiac. If you'd like more personalized predictions for their specific zodiac sign or have any questions about their astrological chart, feel free to reach out to us. Stay tuned for more astrological updates. If they found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more astrology insights. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so they never miss an update. Thank they once again for joining us, and we eagerly anticipate sharing more astrological wisdom with they in the future. Until then, keep exploring, keep learning, and keep shining bright.